my dear today we are going to discuss about one of the most important topic that is known as capillary tube okay so here what we are going to discuss here we are going to discuss what is exactly capillary tube is this is one of the expansion device expansion device and this is also a constant area type expansion device constant area okay constant area type expansion device because there are two types of expansion device one is constant volume type and another one is constant area type extension device all right so basically what happened what is capillary tube is where we used this capillary tube this is most important my dear so what is capillary tube, tube basically well this is used in refrigerator refrigerator so now the next question is what capillary tube exactly do when what capillary tube is going to help us in refri in uh, a refrigerator basically you know what is refrigerator maybe you have watched my all videos okay don't worry just watch my videos you are going to understand each and everything about refrigerator refrigerant and all topics what i have shared till now in this video i mean in this uh, series okay so now let me share with you actually cap what what is what is the meaning of this what this tube is doing in the refrigerator basically this tube tube is doing two things what is that uh, and one more thing where we're going to use this the application of capillary tube is in domestic domestic refrigerator and uh, window ac wac and of, of course water cooler maybe you have seen uh, sometimes in the street water cooler and there we use capillary tube constant area type expansion device so uh, basically what this capillary tube is doing for us basically this capillary tube is used to decrease pressure of the pressure of the refrigerant refri g e r a n t and now let me share with you where we are we used this capillary tube we are having four most important devices in refrigerator one is compressor another one is condenser here we use that capillary tube constant area type or maybe constant volume type okay so we used capillary tube that that is depend on that is de depend on our requirement capillary tube here and the last one we used evaporator well we are not talking about evaporator and uh, condenser but we are talking about capillary tube only so what this capillary tube, uh, the cap the working of capillary tube is decreasing pressure and and in this case we have isenthalpic process that means enthalpy would be constant all right so uh, the most important thing uh, is that what equation we can get from this capillary tube condition if we are using constant area type. So here what happened pressure drop is directly proportional to length of the capillary tube. So length of the capillary tube is also matter. Now next what uh, what we, we are getting next what we are getting uh, we are getting that is uh, uh, this is also inversely proportional to the diameter another thing we know that is acceleration acceleration of fluid acceleration of fluid intake directly proportional to the pressure drop and another last one frictional resistance frictional resistance these four these four thing four not four five things are uh, related to this capillary tube that's why i'm sharing with you so what i might i mean to say this equation is most important especially you are preparing for any competitive examination you know to need to know what capillary tube having and what exactly we need to know okay suppose that most of the time most of the time we have as in case of in case of constant area type capillary tube the relation between pressure drop and diameter directly proportional inversely proportional we can't say and maybe directly proportional maybe inversely proportional 
so what would we answer yes pressure drop is inversely proportional in case of constant area type capillary tube so this is like that only if you know the answer if you know the uh, equation i have shared with you easily we can solve the question i'm just a matter of seconds well thanks for watching hope to see you again in my next video bye bye